Attorney General Barr. Thank you for joining me. As you know, this is... As you know, this impeachment farce is growing worse by the day. And now, a second whistleblower is coming forward. And it's all happening during my busy season. Halloween! Ah! <laughs> Where is the president, Mike? He has more important things to deal with. He's meeting with an alligator breeder about filling the moat at the border. Well, uh, you should have told me I know a couple gators from when I lived in the Central Park Zoo. We, we need to get ahead of this story before it spirals out of control. Did you see those text messages they uncovered? Oh, what? They totally exonerate us. Really? What did they say? Well, uh, this one says... I think we should stop texting about the crimes and maybe tell the crimes over the phone so that the crimes don't leave little crime footprints. It's all taken care of. I can't believe I have to deal with this. I'm supposed to be seeing the new Judy Garland movie with Mother. <laughs> too much, Mike. Uh, presidents get impeached every 30 or 40 years. Now, come on, relax, have another glass of milk. Well, it's 5 o'clock somewhere. Mike Pompeo has returned from Greece and is here to see you. Oh. Hey. Oh. Matthew Roderick. I love him. Mike, weren't you subpoenaed by Congress? I was, but I think I bought myself a little time. This meeting of the House Intelligence Committee will now come to order. Pompeo. Pompeo. <laughs> Listen, listen, I've been asking around, and I think that this whole impeachment thing could be really bad. Who told you that? Like, America? <laughs> Not according to this Breitbart office poll that says 121% of people want Biden impeached. Maybe we should listen to Mike. After all, he is secretary of... Uh, state, I think. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I don't know anymore. My, my ID just says Big Mike. <laughs> That's right. The only original cabinet member left is Ben Carson. Did somebody say my name? <laughs> That's okay, Ben. This isn't your job. Okay, well, I've been sitting in my empty office for like three years. <laughs> and does anybody know what my job is supposed to be? No idea. Anyone? I don't know. I don't know. Even if somebody could maybe give me my password to my computer. <laughs> you know what? I'd better show Mr. Carson out. Oh, but he'll be back, right? Uh, we're in the middle of a crisis here. Oh, uh, for sure. 100%. See you soon. <laughs> Listen, guys, we're going to be just fine. We need to close ranks. You know? Like the mafia. Uh, yeah, except the, the mafia was, like, smart. and tell people the crimes before they did them. Oh, that reminds me. I promised Hannity I would come on a show tonight. I better get into my stage makeup so I look less... <laughs> I'm going, you guys should get your story straight, okay? Something like how Hunter Biden started Pizzagate or how this can all be traced back to Takashi 6 9 <laughs> Whatever the worst idea is, text it to me so the feds have a record. I'll be back. He's probably right. He's probably right about getting our stories straight. Yes, because even if they're not straight now, they could still be converted to straight, right? <laughs> you know, though, uh, the other thing that we could do is just flee the country. There's a whole list of countries that would love to have us. <laughs> North Korea, Saudi Arabia, end of list. <laughs> I'm sorry, who is this guy? I'm the president of Finland. Oh, my God. You're still here from the press conference? Yes. Mr. Trump kept screaming, and then he just walked off. And I did not know if it was over or what. <laughs> You're good. You can go. You're good to go. Thanks. Well, I still want to say the concept of diplomacy is very important. Oh, oh that's, that's cute. Hey, you know what? You know what? I'm going to walk this guy out. Uh, so, uh, what's Finland like? Uh, I mean, to live in. Nice. <laughs> Wait, you're coming back, right, Mike? Because if things go bad for Trump, then I'm president. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's great. Good, that's going to work out just great. I, I can't wait to, for that to happen. <laughs>
Hey, uh, impeachment moves pretty fast. If you don't stop and look around, you might miss it. <laughs> wow. Mm. Well, I'm here all alone. Actually, sir, Stephen Miller wanted to talk to you. <laughs> oh. Huh? Fantastic. Here he is. Oh, thanks for coming by, Stephen. Do you have any way out of this impeachment? <laughs> Nicholas Cage to steal the Constitution and then blame it on immigrants? But, uh, is that a word? God, he's good. <laughs> he's good. And speaking of good, Rudy Giuliani is back from his appearance on Fox News. He's still in stage makeup. <laughs> killed on Hannity! Uh, did you say killed? That's right. And I'll kill again. <laughs> I love the Ferris Bueller reference. <laughs> oh, I hope Andrew Yang wins for sure. <laughs>